Alright, I'm going to be going through this kata for the day. You live in the city of Cartesia, where all roads are laid out in a perfect grid. You arrive 10 minutes too early for an appointment, so you decide to take the opportunity to go for a short walk. The city provides its citizens with a walk generating app on their phones. Every time you press the button, it sends you an array of one letter string strings representing directions to walk, e.g. north, south, west, east. You always walk only a single block for each letter direction, and you know it takes one minute to traverse one city block. So create a function that will return true. If the walk that gives you will exact will take you exactly 10 minutes, you don't want to be early or late, and will of course return you to the same starting point, return false otherwise. Um, cool. So I'm going to just use these as test cases. So I want to start with this right here. And my variable for this function is walk. So walk equals this. Um, I want to stare at this for a second again. So we need to check if it will, if it takes exactly 10 minutes, and then if it returns to the same starting point. Um, so let's do the exactly 10 minutes. That's the easy test to check for. So if um, check if walk is 10 minutes to do this, I'm just going to look at the length. If length of walk does not equal 10, then print false else. So if it does equal 10 minutes, then I need to check to make sure it goes to the same location um, to do this. I was thinking I could count the directions. So walk. So we go north five times. We should go south five times. So cool. So if I check if north and south their accounts are equal to each other, and if I check east and west if their accounts are equal to each other, I think that might work. Um, so if I'm gonna wrap these in parentheses, walk dot count. So if north, the number of times north appears is equal to the number of times south appears. And the number of times east appears is equal to the number of times west appears. Then print true. And then if it doesn't, print false. And let's see if that works. And it appears that it did. So let's run these other test case. So this should return false. Cool. This is just the letter W, so it should return false. Cool. And then this one, I believe, should return false as well. Or, yeah. So there we go. Um, Cool. So let's try and run this in this function now and indent everything. And instead of print statements, I need returns. So return false. Return true. Return false. So it passed all those test cases. Let's try and run it. So it passed everything. So um, this is my solution. Um, let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.